everybody, it's Pat Stacker coming to you with an unboxing video and uh, not a hundred percent sure what's in this one because I have had a few things on pre-order and also I've made several uh, smaller purchases uh, recently um, finish off the year but okay now I know exactly what it is um, so Got some supplies, first of all, and uh, all right, here we go. Okay, we got a couple of things going here. So, first of all, I picked up the one ounce twenty twenty. Lunar Mouse with the Dragon Privy. Alright, and I have um, two of the Perth Mint Lunar 3 boxes. Um, I did an unboxing video for those, but <laughs> it went horribly. <laughs> My camera kept tipping over, and uh, because this space that I do these unboxings is not very big, and those boxes are much bigger than I expected but anyways um, I have one regular lunar mouse and then I wanted to um, pick up one with the dragon privy um, and I also have the lunar ox with the dragon privy um, on pre-order so I'm gonna have one of the regular sets and then I'm gonna have uh, one with the Dragon Privy. That's what I'm going to try to do. Is to get one just normal Lunar 3 series complete one ounce silver set and then one of the uh, Lunar 3 series with this Dragon Privy. So I went ahead and got this. Um, if the regular Lunar Mouse becomes available again, I already have one but I would like to get two. Because what I want to end up doing is selling one, and then if I can also sell the Dragon Privy, um, that'd be great. Alright, and in addition to that, um, as you guys know, I do like to stack some copper from time to time. And uh, lately, I've been seeing it become available, but every time, every time I see it, and I try to pull the trigger, somebody else gets it first. Um, so... Finally, I got this. Um, so, six random design copper rounds. So let's just go ahead and take a look at each one. And they very nicely put um, them in capsules. All right, so here, uh, this is a silver shield design. Um, so three nines fine copper from 2015. And it says, love. Uh, by the way, these are... Um, pre-owned so I bought them used and that's nice pregnant woman um, as you guys know um, as I've said in some recent videos my wife is pregnant right now so um, that's kind of nice kind of nice to have that all right so um, we got ourselves another silver shield from 2015 freedom freedom design all right cool very cool. Um, yeah, 2015 Freedom Design. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Let's see, it looks like Panda Design. Um, so this is from the. Let me see. I think this is from the uh, Sunshine Mint, or no, the Golden State Mint, excuse me, sorry. Because I recognize this, because I have some, I have a tube of uh, Standing Liberty copper rounds, and they have this same design in the back, so this is from Golden State Mint. Um, looks like they just did like a kind of random panda design, so that's nice. You know, guys, I like the pandas. Um, I just did a video on my Chinese pandas, so that's cool with me. And let's see, we got another pregnant lady there. So, um, 
This one's from also 2015. Okay. Cool, cool. Like it. So uh, maybe this is my wife last year. Or at the end of 2018 is when we found out she was pregnant with twins. So, and then it uh, looks like we got a um, Indian head, and this is also from Golden State Mint. I think Golden State Mint, they like to do those. Um, these are like restrikes of classic American coinage. And they, they you know, they have these classic designs. Um, they have Standing Liberty. They have this Indian head one. And that's cool because I don't really, as you know, as a lot of you know, I don't stack the con um, constitutional silver. And I don't have any pre-33 gold either because it's just extremely difficult to find out here in Korea. So... And if I do find it, it's like a novelty item, and it's not worth buying, especially since I'm American. And, you know, if I go back to the States, or I have somebody in the States, um, or I move back to the States someday, I'm not going to be pleased with myself if I've spent a whole bunch of money, like, on, a, on something that... I could have got for a lot cheaper. So I, I do, I really like these Golden State Mint designs of these like traditional American coinage because I do, I'm, in addition to stacking, I'm also into like collecting coins and currency. So um, I do love those designs of those old coins. So we got ourselves another 2015 silver, silver shield, uh, another freedom round. So this is uh, probably uh, this design here is probably one of Silver Shield's most famous um, designs or recognizable designs that I, I've seen anyway um, in my few years of stacking. I've seen this one a lot, so that's cool. You know, um, Silver Shield products, um, not something I'd probably spend my own, I'd go out of the way to spend my own money on, um, but for copper random design copper rounds sure i'll do it yeah, i love it you know so um yeah uh got six ounces of copper and um got this dragon privy year of the mouse um so another ounce of silver and six ounces of copper the copper is the only thing this year guys that i haven't been um you know, moving towards making progress on my goals, but I'm starting to. So hopefully I can get my copper goal um, achieved this year. But for now, uh, which I think it was 25 ounces that I set as my goal. Um, but so we're making progress on that and making progress on the um, Lunar 3 set, the regular one and the Dragon Privy. And when the, the Year of the Ox dragon privy comes in i'll be sure and uh, show you that along with this one and uh, maybe at that time i'll go ahead and show you the case i'll do a special setup and show you the case so uh, at least by the end of the year i'll definitely show you the case um, so anyway that's it for this unboxing guys let me know what you think about all the designs here and what you think about stacking copper and uh, let me know if any of you guys are collecting the Lunar 3 series uh, with any of the Privy Marks. Um, or if you have any of the previous Lunar series with any Privy Marks. Um, if you were to buy... Also, here's a question for you. If you were to buy a full set of Lunar series, would you prefer to buy the regular one? Or would you prefer to buy one that has Privy Mark on it? I mean, who doesn't love the Dragon Privy, you know? Um, dragons are cool. Pretty much everybody likes dragons on coins. So, uh, and it just makes it that much more, you know, unique. You know what I mean? So, I mean, a lot of people have these lunar sets, but do you have the lunar set with the Privy Mark? <laughs> you know? So, like... It kind of makes it a little more exclusive um, in that regard. So um, if you were to just, let's just, let me rephrase the question. If you were to just be, if you were to have a choice between, you know, um, the same price buying with or without the privy, would you get with or without the privy? Um, all right, guys. So that's about it for this one. 
This is Expat Stacker. I'll catch you on the flip side.